coach, the Kaitlyn DeBoer era at Alabama is underway. Your first scrimmage in front of fans. What do you think a highlight of today was, a positive that you saw on the field? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, it's, it's the whole day. You know, it's everyone coming together. It's these guys, uh, you know, going through the last three months and um, everything, you know, with the resiliency that they've been through um, with the transition. I can't you know, say enough about how they've embraced everything. I'm um, proud of them. Uh, today, some highs, some lows, some things we can get better at. Uh, I know they're starving uh, to go out there and be great, and uh, they're going to continue to put in the work. Over 72,000 fans here at one point for a glorified scrimmage. What does that tell you about how hungry this Alabama fan base is? Yeah, I mean, it's it's amazing. It's, uh, it's great to be here. Can't thank them enough, uh, you know, for coming out and supporting our guys. Um, you know, I'm looking forward to this uh, when it's really you know, all packed and, uh, you know, loud and all the energy and the excitement uh, is on another level when we start the season. Your quarterback, Jalen Milrow, was frustrated at the end there. Uh, what can a team accomplish with a competitor like him, a guy who's getting frustrated during a spring game? Yeah, I mean, he's putting the ball where it needed to be. We just got to make the plays, and that's the difference between the first part of the scrimmage and the second part is making the catches and, you know, that is hard when you're when you're putting the ball where it needs to be and, and the ball's on the ground. So, you know, it's just a matter of going back to work, you know, and that's what he does. And maybe a little frustration for a second, uh, but I know he comes back and, and uh, you know, we'll talk about, learn from it. And uh, that's not just him, it's the whole group. All right, thank you, Coach. Congrats on uh, your first spring game with Alabama. Awesome, thank you. Go All back. right, we're going to bring in Jalen Milrow. Hey, Jalen. Hi, congratulations, you won. <laughs> Um, we saw some frustration out of you at the end there. Uh, what frustrated you? How much is that attention to detail going to benefit this team this season? All it is is passion. It's passion. Wanting to, wanting to be the best version of ourselves every single time we touch the field. And the biggest thing, we want to be satisfied. We always have room to grow. We always have things to improve on, stuff like that. But the biggest thing we want to do is stack drive. Stack drive, keep getting better, come to the sideline, regroup. That's all the main focus is. Keep, you know, each drive, be attention to detail, stuff like that. You told me your goal this season was to be the best quarterback in the country. Where do you think that you will make the biggest strides this season? What can Alabama fans expect out of you? And the biggest thing to do right now is to take care of right now. Be the better of myself each and every day I enter the building, uh, play for my teammates, play for the state of Alabama, play for my family. Um, there's a lot of things I'm playing for, but the biggest thing to get to any long-term goal is take care of right now. So I have short-term goals right now um, that I need to accomplish to get to my long-term goals. How good was your running back, Jim Miller, today? That's a dog. He's a dog, man. Uh, no, I'm excited for, for the future for Jam. He comes each and every day, ready to compete, uh, working hard. Um, but I like the whole running back room as a whole. You know, they encourage Jam to play hard and encourage each other, and they have shared success. Um, but I'm super excited for Jam because he's a key resource for our team. So steaks for yourself in the offense, beans and hot dogs for the defense. How much do these bragging rights really matter this offseason? <laughs> Well, you know, it's exciting to take, you know, be here in front of our great fans. Um, but, you know, like the right, the bragging rights we talked about, you know, the biggest thing we have to do is to have fun. Have fun, enjoy the process. Now, along the process, you're going to have success. You're going to have success along the journey. So the biggest thing we have to do is take care of right now and trust the process. All right, enjoy that steak tonight. Thank you. Roll Tide! Give me something. I can feel.